This is tutorial number 84, and it covers the Measure Between feature within CATIA v5. To start off, open up the Fishing Reel step file, which is located on the DVD. Now, what we're going to do in this tutorial is we're going over the Measure Between feature, and it's the first measuring tool in our toolbar. So the Measure Between, it's exactly what the name implies. It measures between any two surfaces, points, whatever it may be. So let's open up the dialog box, so let's click it and we have the definition here. So things that we have to take into consideration are these selection modes. Now when you're selecting uh, objects to measure between, right now it's at any geometry. So if you put your cursor over with the number one there, you're going to see that it's selecting any geometry for the first selection mode. Now any geometry is great because you can choose anything, but sometimes you're only wanting to choose, say, an edge, and sometimes a surface might get in the way so you might have to filter it. So the filtering is found under here, so you can pick uh, points, edges, surfaces, whatever it may be. So let's go ahead and choose our first surface. Let's choose this surface here, and you'll notice after you choose your first uh, selection, it's going to go to the second selection mode. So you're able to change this. So you can do, say, point for the first one and an edge for the second, and that's the only things you're going to be able to select. So now let's select the second one, and we'll choose this face here and we get a distance of 15.006. Now let's click OK, and let's go back to this measure between, and if you go to Customize, you're able to change what's actually shown. Now right now we're showing the minimum distance. Now what if you want to show the maximum distance? So let's click Maximum Distance, click OK, and let's do that same measurement. So let's click this face here, this face here, and now our distance is 16.962. So now we have the maximum distance between those two surfaces. So within the customize here, you're able to toggle and play around with what is actually going to be shown when you measure between two certain objects. So let's click OK. Now let's change these to point only and uh, point only. So let's measure between a few points. So let's choose a point right here and let's choose a point right here. And now it's measuring between those two points. Now say as we're designing that we always want to see this measurement uh, while we're working on stuff, all you have to do is click Keep Measure, and when you click OK, it's going to stay there. So you're able to keep that measurement in mind while you're looking at it, or if you have to, say, send a screenshot of the, your part, you have the dimension in there showing in the 3D how the dimension is related and what's going on with it. So the measure tool, it's a great way to measure everything in your uh, part. So you're able to filter out your, uh, your selections and you're able to change what it, exactly it is you're measuring. And that concludes our tutorial on how to use the measure between feature within CATIA v5.